working on a about a nine acre section of a field it's about to finish up and um, you notice I've got a bad HR, AHRS showing that's because I'm having compass troubles but I kind of just need to get the field cut so I'm, it's working really pretty well I'm using the internal compass in the Pixhawk which of course is not very good but uh, and with all the electromagnetic noise and all I have with this mower it's uh, you know I've never I've had a lot of trouble with compasses but what I wanted to show kind of is related to that. It's very interesting to see that um, as my mower makes turns, I've always had trouble with this. Uh, you notice when it's headed south and turning to the east, it overshoots and turns back too far to the north before correcting back. It's tracking pretty well once it gets on the line. But notice when it's turning uh, from the east to the north, it undershoots basically it, it loops out to the east and then when it's turning back the other direction back toward the west it loops up toward the north undershoots again but then it overshoots when it's turning back south coming from the east headed toward the west turning south so what it appears is it I believe this is very much compass related because it when it's turning toward a north or south direction it always moves too far to the east in other words this moved too far to the east this stopped short meaning it headed to the east as well before it corrected back to the north and then the same thing similar thing when we're turning uh, toward a, an east direction as in this one down here or a west direction as this one it overshoots or undershoots to the north. It always takes off from the curve in a northerly direction before correcting back. In this case, it turned too far so that it headed back. I've struggled with all kinds of tuning, thinking this was a pivot turn issue and so forth, but I, you know, it just looks too obvious to be uh, related. It looks to be obviously related to compass. So I'm looking forward to getting a moving base type Jeep compass or not compass but heading based on GPS uh, and getting rid of the uh, magnetic compass altogether at some point so anyway uh, hope I'll get some more videos out soon but thought I'd show this one I thought was a little bit interesting